An inmate serving time in Mount Carmel has a new store opening in Northumberland County called Athletic Drip, where shoppers will find shoes for men, women and children, along with apparel. Fox 56's Taylor Wartonby live tonight with a look inside. Taylor. That's right, Thomas Coffee is trying to do good in the community and set a good example so kids don't go down the wrong path. So he knows sneakers is a big thing for kids, so it's going to bring the kids to the store so he can share his story with them. While behind bars, Thomas Coffee, who has been incarcerated for nearly 10 years, is trying to make a difference within the community and help the youth. And with the help of his family, those ideas have become a reality. There was an incident in Philadelphia that got him incarcerated up in Mount Carmel, PA, Cole Township area, um, where it's a situation of guilty by situation, wrong place, wrong time, just being in a bad area. He wants to instill, let the kids know, you know, you don't always have to be guilty to be put in that situation. So he wants to push them in a better direction, better light, focus on school. Essentially the point is to bring these kids here. We have many plans of giving back to them. So we want to keep them in a positive light. Tess John's Coffee, Thomas's wife, says they purchased the building about a year or two ago. It was supposed to be a diner, but it wasn't Thomas's passion. She shares making this all possible has been a lot and will love for Thomas to be here as he would be a great role model for the youth. He just came up with the idea because we're always giving back. Um, sneakers is what kid, attracts kids. Sneakers are going to attract them in the store. It's going to bring business to the area. There's no sneaker store here in this area, nowhere close. He would like to um, share his story so it would touch somebody, you know, somebody, some youth, some child, some young man in that same position where he's just wrong place, wrong time. You stay focused on school, you stay focused on your outlet, which is sneakers, basketball, anything. Stay focused on those things so you can stay in a positive direction and not end up in a situation like his. Thomas's wife Tess says kids are already knocking on the doors wanting to come in, saying they heard about Thomas's story and they are inspired by him. Their grand opening will be tomorrow. Reporting live, I'm Taylor Whartonby with Fox 56 News, first at 10. Taylor, thanks. We have